Modern day sterilizers are all subject to various types of testing at periodic intervals of their life cycle. As the W&H Lisa sterilizer is classed as a type B vacuum, the correct weekly testing, as described within manufacturers and national decontamination guidance, is an air leakage test. The Lisa version of the air leakage test is termed a vacuum test and can be found within the test cycles submenu. A vacuum test is required as part of conformity to national decontamination guidance. It tests the integrity of the Lisa sterilizer's closed pneumatic circuit. The vacuum test cycle should be the first cycle performed on the first day of every week the sterilizer is in operation. The vacuum test is to be run before any further daily testing, for example, helix, or running a normal cycle. Prior to the test, it is imperative to ensure that the temperature of the internal chamber is cold, or no greater than ambient room temperature. This can be checked by viewing the T-Chamber EXT value on the menu screen. You should also confirm that all trays have been removed from the chamber and any signs of condensation and or water have been removed. Close the door and select the Vacuum Test Cycle from the Test Cycle submenu. Once the Vacuum Test Cycle has been successfully completed, the display panel on your Lisa sterilizer will display Test Passed. Once the door has been opened, the menu display will indicate your Lisa sterilizer can now be prepared for daily testing. All test results should be documented in a logbook specific to the sterilizer in accordance with national decontamination guidance. Further information on product maintenance, compliance testing and current national decontamination guidance can be found on this website. For all other inquiries, please click Contact Us or email us at the following address.